I ain't gonna lie, that does not look like Logan Paul. Logan Paul, man, bro, your girl, I don't know if you're aware, but your girl's getting exposed all over Twitter, dog. Like, it's gotten to the point where I'm actually tired of seeing her, you know what I mean? This dude Dylan Danis has been exposing pictures of Logan Paul's current fiance. And I gotta be honest, I had no clue who this dude was before this, and I didn't even know there was a fight before this. But anyways, this dude has been posting, uh, photos of Logan Paul's fiance with every possible, uh, not even, like, high, high up celebrities, but, like, these, like, low-end celebrities possible, like, Riff Raft, I, you probably have no clue who that is, but, like, I mean, I kinda have heard that. My main goal is to blow up. And then act like I don't know nobody. <laughs> I mean, bro, for this video, I took a bunch of screenshots on my phone and sent it to myself on a, a like a file transfer Discord server that I'm only in. And look at this, bro. Look how many they are. And some of these could be photoshopped. Some of these could just be like, oh, uh, you know, we could give her the benefit of the doubt and she's just meeting celebrities to take photos with, maybe. Some of these could be just a photo shoot and, uh, you know, just a little raunchy photo shoot, which. If you're okay with your girl doing this in the past and you still love her, then that's on you, bro. I don't know, man. Like, he brings up a great question. Whose 40th birthday party was it? You know what I mean? Like, 40th? Oh, uh, she a gold digger. Speaking of which, she uh, had a photo with the dude that did the gold digger vocals. Uh, Jamie Foxx. But, like, some of these dudes, like, I, I don't know if they, like, actually, like, would have done anything. Because she had a photo with LeBron James. And it's like, if you see LeBron James, are you not going to take a photo with him? I mean, doesn't the dude have a wife and, like, kids and stuff? I don't think he would, like, risk it all for that. And she got photos with a bunch of, like, old dudes, too. Like, I don't know. Like, I don't even know who these old dudes are. So, it's kind of weird. Maybe they asked her for a photo. I don't know, man. But, like, who is this? Like, Jimmy Carter? I don't even know who these guys are. I think this is, like, the Count Dudu guy from, like, Star Wars or something. Count Dooku. Like, I just want to say every dude's girl got exes, right? But, like, half the planet? Half of, like, the celebrity lineup? Like, this chick got Leonardo DiCaprio. Uh, the dude from Shark Boy. Uh, I don't even know who some of these people are, I'm gonna be honest. Like, maybe I'm just, maybe I'm just ignorant. Uh, let's get checked. Logan, as your best man, I advise, you, I advise you take the kit from her and get checked, brother. Okay, that is just weird. Uh, oh my god, she's getting, like, tossed around in, in this photo. This is just a raunchy photo shoot. Uh, here she is with, like, with an alien. This guy's built, like, his refrigerator, apparently. The, the bloke from The Flash. I don't know who this kid is. Uh, Tommy Lee. The dude from Biodome, that's wild. It's crazy. Well, the wild part is you don't even remember his name either, and I don't even know what the f Biodome is, so. Uh, then, of course, we got Riff Raft again, uh, this, and then she's taking a photo with a, with a whipped cream bikini that I don't even think YouTube's going to allow me to show on this photo, but she's taking it with two other dudes, a bunch of old mother and uh, a basketball player who, I, I'm gonna not gonna lie, once again, I have no clue who this basketball player is, but like, maybe he's not even a basketball player. Sorry for any mistakes I've made, I uh, kind of just raw dog that in one take, no pun intended. Oh my god, bro, look, this one looks kind of photoshopped though. Who is this Mexican? She had a bunch of pictures with like a bunch of short Mexicans, and I don't even think like, I don't even think these dudes are celebrities, like, I, they, Ja Rule? Wow, Nina Edgell is now banging Mike Trout. How is this gonna affect the Trout population? Trying to make Bryce jealous after he dumped her and got back with his ex fiance. No, this might be just a side note, but I hate like these celebrity like headlines. Like, you ever like go to the grocery store and see like those celebrity magazines, dude? Like, every time I just glance at them, I can feel my brain rotting. And I just wanna say, like, while I was screenshotting these, I was like, when does it end, bro? When does it end? Because I was screenshotting all the way back to where it didn't even say like how many days ago it was. It just said the date. I'm like, dang, we're, we're over here in like August like 3rd almost or something. Like August 7th or something. This dude's been posting these daily. Like five times a day daily for the past two weeks, bro. And it's like as Logan Paul, like what are you doing, bro? You better be training. You better be in the mountains meditating or something, man. Because I ain't gonna lie, like... They was even doing, like, betting odds to see, like, if he's gonna call off the wedding. And it's like, bro, like, I'm gonna be honest. Like, look, 
boxing is boxing. Y'all are gonna get in the ring and like punch each other and there there might be tension and stuff, but like, ain't this a little far? Like, you out here like ruining like people's lives and shit, bro. Like, ain't that a little far? Like as I'm editing this video, dude, he just posted a picture of her with Bill Nye the Science Guy. Bill, Bill Nye, the science, Nye the science Guy? Nah, okay, like I will be honest, some of these could just be her like, oh, this is a cool celebrity that I noticed. Let me just take a photo with them. Like, I, just because there's a photo together does not mean anything happened. But there is some photos of her where you could just tell, yeah, these guys got some weird sexual tension going on. But like I said before, I don't even follow this Dylan Danis dude. I had no clue who this dude was before, like yesterday. And all I am is seeing Logan Paul's hoe all over my timeline, dude. I do not want to see this. You need to stop posting this right now. Logan Paul, you need to knock this dude out. Not only for disrespecting your wife or whatever, but like man to man, bro. Like, I don't want to see this on my timeline. Like, it's disrespectful to me. It's disrespectful to you. It's disrespectful to almost everybody because ain't, ain't nobody trying to see all this, man. Like, you got to knock him out for all of us. I'm not even a Logan Paul fan, bro, but you got to knock him out for posting this on my timeline. Like, I don't even follow this dude. Logan Paul, you got to knock out Elon Musk, too, for having his algorithm put this motherfucker on my timeline no i'm not gonna lie though i had no clue there was a fight going to happen and i think aiden ross shares his opinion with me where like this definitely made a fight that nobody knew was going on into a fight that everybody's excited for like i am waiting to see if logan paul is gonna knock this dude stark out and i will be cheering for him but logan paul if you get knocked out or if you even lose bro like man bro after all this i don't i i I got some things I, I I can't even say on YouTube. I think it's funny how she has like rarities onto these like celebrity photos, like LeBron James and Leonardo DiCaprio. We already know those are like triple S, all ultra rare. And then uh, you might have like the bloke from uh, the, the Flash. He's just like a regular like rare. Uh, then like the Mexican guys are just like commons or something. I don't know. It gets even deeper too, where she like leaked some screenshots about Logan Paul when they had like a fight or something. And now she's trying to like defend him. And she's aware that this dude is spreading her images online and she's not happy about it. And it's just like, man, this is just a huge mess. This is too much drama over a boxing match. I also learned that Logan Paul fired some shots at his girlfriend too. And this is why he's doing it. So if that is the case, then Hey, look, game is game, fair game. And I'm actually kind of looking forward to this fight against my own will. I was not wanting to look forward to this fight, but after learning what's going on on Twitter, I am now looking forward to it. So, hey, like, look, I'm rooting for you, Logan. Uh, even if you do win, maybe you should reconsider your, uh, your, uh, your marriage options. But, like, at least you don't go down as a loser, though, right? Like, at least... You can't lose and then and then reconsider. You gotta win and then reconsider. You know what I mean? So, because if you lose and you reconsider, then it's gonna make it look like this dude influenced your decisions. But if you beat his ass and then reconsider, then it's gonna make it look like you came to this decision on your own. But also, maybe Logan is into slutty women. Hey, I mean, the Idubs was and he openly admitted that. So maybe that's just the thing you guys are into nowadays.